Now, how you install this Revo tank, you, some people would probably ask. I wanted to make a video. And so solidly, too. Alright. You don't want it to be too solid. I mean, you still want it to move. Because otherwise it could break something. I'm, I'm trying to think ahead what we can do to help it not break stuff. But yet, yeah, it has such a big tank on it. A 125cc. Instead of 75. And what you do, you have to have a sport, alright? Sport's way different. They don't have slipper clutches. I took that off because I want all the power to get. And they usually, when they're stock, they don't have these shocks either. But anyways, then they also have a 1.5. But I put a th if you want to put a 3 or just plain bigger gas tank on it, find out exactly where you want the tank. Like, I want mine out a little bit away. You want away from all the air filters and stuff so this stuff can still move. Now what you do, you once you find the place you drill the hole for this and you put an exhaust screw up and use a washer. Wait, where is it? Right there. And you want to tighten it pretty good. And you use the nut that fits that screw. And how I secured the side zip tie and some other kind of mount. I don't know what kind. You'll have to fight, figure that on your own. And then tie it to the frame. That lets it move. And that's all. And then you just use it.